Hello people, this is your boy Milan, all the way from Nepal, country of Buddha and Mount Everest, welcome to you all. Today I am going to draw Victor Mouth in Adobe Illustrator. Let's get started. First of all create a new document, here I choose A4 size for this tutorial. Go to file and open the image. Then select the image copy it and paste it to our original file. Now let's resize it. Keep in mind press shift while resizing the image so that images resize in equal proportion. Let's resize it so that mouth fill ups our file nice and clear. Then let's lock this layer as we don't want to make any changes in original image and create a new layer. Let's zoom it to the center, by pressing Ctrl and space at the same time and clicking and dragging with mouse. Let's select pen tool from the panel or simply hit P on keyboard. Then let's trace the upper lip with the pen tool. I hope you know how to use pen tool. Let me switch to stroke color so that we can see where we are tracing. Similarly to the lower lip as well. Just trace it out with pen tool. Now as we have completed tracing the lips, let's trace the teeth part. Let's zoom it nice and clear and start tracing. If you have problem using pen tool, let me know in the comment section below, I would love to help you guys. Similarly now let's trace the shinning part of lower lips. Similarly let's trace the shinning part of the upper lips as well. Now in this kind of situation we have to intersect the shapes. First select the shape from which you want to intersect the other shape. Then simply go to edit copy it and again go to edit and click paste in front. Now there are two copies of the shape. Simply choose one of them and the part that you want to intersect. Then click this option in pathfinder menu. This intersects the part. If you don't see this option go to windows and choose pathfinder. Let's group the similar shapes, the shinning part of lower lips. Select all the shapes and press Ctrl and G to group shapes. Now let's trace out the darker part of lower lips.
Then let's intersect the unwanted shape as we did earlier before. Similarly now let's trace the cracked like part in the lower lips. I am just changing the color so that we can see what am I doing. After tracing all, just select a single shape, and then go to select, and choose same, then choose fill and stoke. This selects all the shape with same color, and then group them, control and G. Now select the lower lip shape, then choose eyedropper tool, and choose the color you want in lower lip. To change the color, simply press control plus Z to undo, and choose another color. Now to color the darker part, select the shape and choose the lip color with eyedropper tool. Then double clicking here choose more darker color. Similarly to shining part with lighter color.